everyone welcome back to another video so today we are going to be nesting i am going to be washing and organizing all of the baby's clothes it's one of the last things that i still yet to do before the baby girl gets here i will be exactly 38 weeks pregnant on thursday and today is monday when i'm filming this so we have a little bit more to go before we get to meet this little girl Here's a little baby bump shot, almost 38 week baby bump shot. So we're getting big and huge, um, but it's one of the last things I still yet to do. So I thought I would get it done today. Um, the boys are downstairs. I turned on cartoons for them for a little bit so I could come up here and get some things done. I showed you guys in my last video, like I did a huge Amazon haul. I showed you guys everything that I bought for the baby girl. So everything is still in the box, in the packages. So I need to take everything out, wash everything and find a place for it. So we're gonna do that today. We're also going to organize the dresser. I showed you guys, I bought these um little like dresser organizers so we're gonna use those to organize the baby stuff i also need to um take everything out of the closet wash everything we're gonna have to do a lot of laundry today and just get things ready for the baby so that is my plan for right now um it's probably going to take me all day to do this honestly but we're gonna get it done. So I'm gonna go ahead, set you guys up, and we're gonna get right to work. So I think first I'm gonna go through this Amazon box and just take everything out of the packages. I'm gonna put everything that needs to be washed in this little laundry basket. Um, and I still get to take all the little tags off, but you guys, how cute. If you guys haven't watched my amazon haul i'll link it down below but i showed you guys everything that i bought for the baby girl oh my goodness so adorable her cute little bows i have like a little bow collection for her let me actually show you guys Where are they? here's her little bow collection so I started like a little bow collection for her. She already has a couple. I'm gonna add these to her little collection. Honestly, you guys, I still cannot believe that I'm like going to have a little girl. I feel like every mom wants a little daughter, like a little best friend. So um, I feel so blessed and lucky to have one of each. Obviously, I love my boys, but I always wanted a little girl and I finally get one. So Now moving on to her closet, I'm basically going to be washing everything that's in here. Um, I'm going to take everything off the hangers. I think I'm gonna wash only. I think I'm gonna wash only like the newborn in zero to three months. Um, the things that she might be wearing like right away, and I don't think I'm gonna wash like three to six months because she won't be able to wear this like for a little while. So. There's really no point. Yeah, so I don't think I'm going to wash anything that's like three to six months just yet. But I will wash everything that's newborn, zero to three. I'm going to also wash all of her little onesies. 
so things that she might be wearing like right away things that we will need i also have like swaddle blankets some blankets that i need to wash so we're gonna do that right now um i gonna take everything off this is new so going to need to take all the tags off her closet and her dresser and I think I have everything that I want to wash um hopefully I'm not missing anything so I don't have to like redo the loads of laundry but I have full three bins of laundry here so this is everything that I'm going to be washing um I'm going to take everything downstairs into the laundry room and I think I'm going to separate them by colors I'm going to do like a load of just the whites the colors and then maybe I'll do like a separate load of just like the hats and the socks and all like little things so we'll see I get to um, separate into piles but right now I'm gonna take everything downstairs hopefully they're not too heavy um, but yeah and then we'll come back and finish organizing her dresser I'm gonna um, organize that little pile put everything into her dresser organize her closet and we're making progress so i'm gonna go ahead take these downstairs hopefully they're not too heavy and we'll start on the laundry right now i am in my laundry room i'm going to start washing everything i just finished taking all the tags off the baby clothes and i kind of separated everything into the piles how i want to wash everything so in this bin i just have like mainly all light colors and whites and then in here i have more of like bigger things so like the crib sheets the towels the blankets and then in here i have um like darker colors and more of like colored uh baby clothes so i'm going to have three loads of laundry to do and also i am going to try to stain uh, spot treat some of this onesies that I am reusing they have like little yellow stains on them so hopefully th those come off I'm going to use this oxyclean stain remover and hopefully that um, takes off the yellow stain so we're gonna start doing the laundry I'm going to use this newborn laundry detergent and start washing everything so I'm gonna go ahead and do my first load of laundry right now are you gonna help mama charlie's taking his nap right now and vincent is gonna help me do the laundry let's get to it
it is already 2.26. I'm taking a little break. Um, I'm in the kitchen making myself some food because we're getting a little bit hungry over here. So I'll show you guys what I'm going to be having. I just made, um, cut up some strawberries. I toasted some bagel and then to go on top of my bagel, I'm going to put a little bit of Nutella because craving something a little bit sweet so we're gonna satisfy our cravings and have a little bit of nutella but that is going to be my quick like midday i guess snack um charlie is still taking his nap and once he wakes up i'm gonna go back to the room and finish organizing everything i still have so much to do you made mommy sushi oh my baby Thank you, sweet baby. Okay, that's cute. Hopefully they fit. These are the Amazon storage cubes that I showed you guys from my Amazon haul. And I really like how they fit into this drawer. They fit perfectly. So um, this is just the one pack. I have one more, so I think I'm going to do another one in this drawer and organize everything a little bit better. And then I'll keep one drawer for just the diapers and the wipes. So... I'm gonna go ahead, open this one up, and do the same thing in this drawer. So it's gonna look really, really nice. tired but i just finished um somewhat organizing the dresser i'll show you guys in a minute what i have in there but it's somewhat organized i'm sure like i'll reorganize things as i go but um the tab drawer i'm planning to keep like the diapers and the wipes in which i still have to put but i'll do that in a minute and then in here i just have um like socks hats um, little bibs and just miscellaneous things and then at the bottom I'm planning to keep like blankets, bath towels, um, little swaddles and things like that so that is what I'm gonna keep in here and as far as the closet goes in the closet I'm going to keep all of her baby clothes that is what I'm going to do right now I just finished doing all of her laundry. This is all of her like newborn zero to three months clothes. So I'm going to be putting everything back into closet. And I also have some of these um, little drawer dividers left over that I didn't end up using in the dresser. So I'm going to try to use them in the closet and maybe like fold her little pants in here or maybe like little onesies or something like that. So we're going to end up using them in some way. Um, and then, yeah, I'm just going to start putting everything on the hangers and putting everything back into the closet. You guys, I didn't realize how much work this is. It's literally taking me all day to do this and having like two boys on top of this it just makes it so much harder my husband is finally home from work so he's with them outside so i can finish this um honestly i should have probably like saved some of this for tomorrow but i feel like i'm already so far behind um and it's like stressing me out so i need to get everything done finish everything up so we're ready uh to go and meet our little girl whenever she decides to 
um, make appearance. So I'm gonna go ahead and start putting everything onto the hangers and back into the closet. <music> I want to do for the day but I'll show you guys how everything turned out in a minute um, I do want to fill up this drawer with um, all the diapers and wipes so I'm going to do that right now I'm gonna set you guys up right here so this first drawer of the dresser is going to be all diapers and wipes um, since this is going to be like a changing station I want like an easy access to diapers and wipes so I already bought uh, newborn size diapers and I'm going to take them out and fill them up in this drawer. So I did buy only one box for now just in case we don't end up using these diapers. Um, these are the diapers I used with both of my kids. So we shouldn't have any problems, but just in case she has like a diaper rush or something, we might have to switch over. So I just bought like one box for now. And then I also did buy um, size one diapers just in case. So I'm going to fill up the drawer with diapers so we can be ready to go let's see how tiny these are oh my gosh you guys these little diapers are so tiny let me show you <laughs> look how tiny they are these are the newborn size diapers and look this is my hand this is the diaper how tiny i can't even I think I'm all done for the day. I'm gonna show you guys how everything turned out. 
So in this drawer, I'm going to keep all the diapers and wipes just so it's nice and easy access to when I'm changing the baby. And then in the second drawer, I still might end up like reorganizing everything, but this is how it is right now. In this bottom drawer, I have her bath towels, crib sheet, um, blankets are under there. Here we have some swaddle blankets um these are swaddles as well but these are the um this one is the halo swaddle and this one is love to dream swaddle and then these are just these disposable little mats that i'm sure i will end up using so that is what i have in the dresser so far over here, I still yet to organize everything. I might get to it tomorrow, but for now, we're just going to leave it as is. I'll show you guys what I have going on um, over here. So here we just have her like uh, long sleeve little like sweaters. Here we have her newborn to zero to three months like sleepers. And honestly, this is probably like what we're gonna use the most so i wanted to have everything on the hanger so i can easily see everything and then here at the end i just have um her warm little jackets for when we are transitioning into like fall and winter so we have that and then here in these little storage bins that i didn't end up using in the dresser i organized all of her short sleeve onesies in here i have her long sleeve onesies and then in here i have her pants so we have that and then over here this is all the stuff that um i didn't wash it's three to six months clothes so she won't be able to wear that for a little while and then at the bottom over here we just have like her little shoes um some more extra blankets extra diapers and this is probably going to be her like little laundry bin so that is everything you guys that is going to be it for this vlog that is all that i'm going to do today i'm probably going to organize a little bit more tomorrow get more things done um but yeah i'm so happy i got to finally wash everything um that was like one of my last things to do on my like to-do list i also need to wash everything that's in my hospital bag over there um, I have it packed, but I still need to wash everything. So I'm going to do that, and then I'm going to film um, what's in my hospital bag. So that video might be coming up next. So make sure you are subscribed to our vlogging channel, and I will see you all in my next video. Bye!